how to add moderators to your YouTube channel and how do you choose them. That's what we're talking about in today's video. Welcome to the Doug Houston YouTube channel. This video is part one of a two part series on YouTube live streaming moderation. Make sure to check out part two when it drops. If this is your first time here, welcome. This channel is about all things tech, software, tutorials, and even YouTube. So if you're into that sort of information, why not subscribe and click the bell for speedy notifications. Part one is all about you as a YouTuber and live streamer applying moderation features to your channel and selecting people for your moderation team. Here we go. Why have comment and live chat moderators? As your channel grows and your live stream audience increases, it will quickly become difficult to self-moderate your live stream chats. This necessitates the implementation of both moderation filters and real life moderators on your live streams. Moderation options, filters and third party apps. YouTube provides some basic moderation and filtering options that work both on live stream chats and video comments. Go to create a studio, click on community and then community settings. The top section called automated filters is all about moderation. The two key sections for automation are the blocked words and block links. I recommend checking the block links box, which will stop anyone posting links in your chat and your comments. Both you and your moderators and approved users are exempt. Blocked words is the secret source of your YouTube live chat moderation. Any set of words or phrases you do not want to appear in your comments or your streams can be added here including cuss words. Comments and chat messages that contain these words and phrases will be hidden for moderator approval before appearing. Advanced third-party tools like Nightbot can also assist as a virtual moderator, but I recommend that if you use those tools, you study the options very carefully and test the settings so that Nightbot does not take over your live chat. If you want a video on Nightbot, leave a comment below. Before adding moderators to your channel, here are some things to consider about choosing them. Number one, where do you find them? Well, you could consider your friends and family, but the best source of moderators is your loyal fan base. Number two, trustworthy. Pick someone you have a track record with, someone who's earned your trust, even on an internet friend level. Number three, loyal. They have been a regular supporter of your channel and they've been regular on your live streams. You don't wanna pick up someone who's just rocked up yesterday. Number four, helpful. The person that you choose should be community minded and already helping out in the live stream, answering questions and pointing people in the right direction. Number five, like-minded. Choose people who are aligned with your beliefs and what your channel's about. Now, how do you go about adding someone as a moderator? Well, there's two ways. You can add the moderator to your channel settings. Go into create a studio, click community, community settings, go to automated filters and moderators. And in that field, paste the full channel URL of the person you want to add. You can also add a person as a moderator during your live stream. Just go over to the chat, click on the three dots next to their name and click add as moderator. Done, simple as that. Once a person has been added, they're good to go. Moderator's names appear in blue in chat with a wrench next to their names. Stay tuned for part two of this series all about moderating during a live stream. Make sure you got notifications turned on so you know when it drops. And if it's already come out since you started watching this video, then the link will be up here in the cards right now. 
Make sure to leave comments in the comments below if you have any questions about choosing moderator or any of the moderation tools we talked about today. If you thought this video was helpful to you, why not give it a thumbs up? And if you really liked it, don't forget to share it with those that you think they need to know. And don't forget to subscribe. This is Doug from Doug Hughes on YouTube, and I'm out.